Drug design in bioinformatics basically uses the computational methods to create new drugs by identifying and optimizing the potential drug molecules to interact with the biological targets. This process leverages computer-added drug design, that is CADD, including the techniques like molecular docking to significantly speed up the discovery, reduces the costs, and analyze the large data sets. Now, when we are saying protein ligand docking, then you need to understand what is the docking term and what in exact it means. So it is basically a term of computational chemistry that attempts to find the best matching between two molecules, a receptor and a ligand. So protein ligand docking, you need to understand the global and local docking, as I have mentioned, rigid and flexible docking or semi-flexible docking, bound and unbound docking. Finding the best place and orientation of interaction. Thinking of a local docking as finding the best fit in a specific room, while global docking is searching for the entire house for any possibly possible room to be fit. Local is faster and more accurate for the known sites. Global is essential when the binding location is unknown, often using randomization and exploration. Now, best for refining known interaction, local docking. And global docking or blind docking, which is mostly used, is discovering new interactions irrespective of the reason. So, rigid docking treats both the ligand and the receptor as the fixed. Inflexible molecules making it computationally fast but less accurate because biologically it is impossible. While flexible docking conversely allows for conformational changes in one or both molecules to achieve a more accurate and realistic prediction. One thing for drug is popcap, where you can get most of the molecules structures. Then PDB from where you can get the known protein structure. Then Uniprot, which will help you to get the primary sequence of the protein so that you can predict the 3D structure of the protein by using alpha fold or some other uh, softwares.